Hello and welcome to Dalaran Models YouTube channel. My name is Dallas and in this video I'll be opening the box of the Tamiya Ferrari LaFerrari in 124th scale. So to start with let's get the box open and presented with obviously as usual with Tamiya parts lots of plastic bags with staples in. So let's have a look at these parts as we get them and we've got the back plate for the chassis, the inner door panels and a few of the pieces on this sprue and looking at them they're quite crisp as you would expect from Tamiya no visible problems that I can see um, and then the next one we've got the moulded in red outer body panels with the LaFerrari, Enzo, various other Time of your kits of late, um, there's lots of little parts rather than whole body uh, assembled all together on these kits. Um, and again, you can see that they're very crisp quality mouldings. Um, not any any problems, not any flash or anything that you can see. Um, there's various build-ups for the doors, the uh, little vents and things not moulded in that need gluing. So probably be some sanding that will be required there and then the uh, rear bumper is attached there and then you've got wheels moulded in there or co coated in their silver sort of aluminium which is quite nice compared to uh, some other kits you see and then you've got the exhaust tips which are quite detailed and on the other side you've got your um, centre caps for the wheels so they're very nicely moulded. Next one is grey screw that uh, has some engine parts on it. Uh, nice detailed engine pieces there. Um, some extra, um, all the uh, things that build up the engine and the running gear. You got the the seats, the uh, brake discs and various su suspension components there um, again very nice moulding next up we've got a black screw which has all the chassis components on so you've got your main part of the tub there uh, which everything basically attaches to you in a cockpit your engine will go in this section here and then you've got your rear wheel bays, various things for the lights, dashboard, top of the engine cover, the top where the windscreen would attach to, and another under tray there, and a couple of other bits for the interior and suspension. And under here we have the clear part, so we've got one moulded in red, which has the rear light assembly clustering and then we've got all the windscreen uh, I'm not sure whether that's an under panel um, rear screen side screens and your light lenses I'll keep those in the bag for now so they don't get scratched last piece you've got screw wise is the front bumper which looks quite nice um, don't envision any problems with these with it being a tammy kit to uh, nothing and toward expected with the fit, although I have heard that the rear engine cover can not necessarily fit well, but we will see when we get to that. This one has the decal sheets, the little metal, if I can get it out, the metal uh, decals, or whatever you call them metal transfers uh, for the mirrors and the lights and the Ferrari logo in there as you can see there and then you've got a window um, mask which is from what I can gather has been pre-cut and then the decal sheet is here which is uh,
got some fairly nice detail to it. So some mesh decals there, which I'm not quite sure where they will go as they've provided a additional mesh um, sheet to uh, go on various panels. And then lastly in the box, not lastly, you've got a uh, sheet in here that has some, some little bit of information on the actual car, but then you've got your instruction sheet, which again follows normal Tamiya way of doing things. So they've got your tools that you need, your paint codes, um, a few tips on how to do things. Um, and then your build out, you've got your engine assembly and the exhaust and then attaching that to the actual chassis and the underbelly, building up the suspension, the brakes, and then uh, going through a few more under trays attached, wheel wells, and then finishing off the engine bay, attaching the rear firewall and starting to assemble the cockpit and the dashboard, steering wheel, all the rest of it, windscreen goes in um, and then you start on the outer body panels um, which as you can see here you can see the build up for the um, doors with the vents that need attaching which will probably need a bit of filling and sanding attached to those you've got extra pieces for the front bumper, this is where the uh, mesh goes out with your cutouts which I believe are to scale um, so you mask over those, transfer it to your mesh and then cut them out. Um, and then final assembly for the body panels onto the, onto the main car and there we go. So next video which will be coming soon, we'll go through starting the build of it. So thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed it.